Avi is about to give us a tour of the entire Bay Area. Um, uh, welcome to a uh, lecture series number 34. Today we're talking about uh, the topology of the microclimates of uh, the Bay Area. And it, it really- Pressure systems. Yeah, we're, we're, we're getting into these dynamic systems here and really it's the intersection of two big fields in uh, modern um, marinology. Uh, marinology for <laughs> those of you in the UK. Marinerology. But in all seriousness, I would like to address the pending extinction of the Western bottlenose dolphin. Dude, shut, shut up. <laughs> um, yeah, we're, we're not here for ethical. Oh, fuck. I've been attacked. Anyway, sorry. Um, so, as you can see, this is actually the only place where this phenomenon occurs. It's called serial bullying. And what happens is you can see that the, the child that is in charge of filling up the cereal bowl over here has been distracted. And now he's poured too much milk into the cereal bowl. And as you can see right here, this is a little crack in the top of the bowl. And you can see the milk flowing into the rest of the negative space. And it's, it's an incredible phenomenon. And you can actually watch the turbulence as these things have to curve around different buildings. And you can see that this is actually a local minima right there. That's the <laughs> channel that the Golden Gate Bridge like spans. And you can see how it actually stretches out through there. Everywhere else, there's too much turbulence. There's too much upforce that basically kind of compresses the it. fog and makes it burn off. But right there, there's not a lot. And so the fog is allowed to remain much farther. Just plow almost getting through. to Berkeley. Yeah, Wait, that wasn't funny. That was just reality. Um, yeah, it just plows straight through. There's, it just plows there's nothing, there's nothing blocked. Kind of like Ben. It's just last night. How'd you learn that? It's just obvious. I'm just making it up. Um, no, that's actually true. Yeah. It's just the Golden Gate is a different. Dude, you have a whole audience now. You gotta keep going. Plows, yeah. Plows um, straight through. Yeah. And. Wow. It, it's actually really interesting. During wildfire season, uh, you can see that. Uh, dude, I have no idea what to say now. <laughs> okay, just. Oh, what are all the different areas? Like, it's a giant what, cloud boat. Where's, where's, where's Berkeley? Oh, yeah. where's... Let's, let's talk about the gentrification of this yeah. area. Oh, yes. Wait, and the different, the different subcultures that go on inside of the bay. Yes. So we have San Francisco. San Francisco used to have culture. Now it doesn't. It's just a bunch of tech bros that don't really have personalities. And they just <laughs> hang out there. Oakland still has culture. Oakland was like kind of the place there, there was a lot of like industrial stuff there it has the port so it used to be like a really industrial city <laughs> and you had a lot of africans african americans move there wow. like in the 80s and or before the 80s but then when the 80s hit you had this massive like white flight from oakland and they all moved over those hills so we hate everybody over those hills and then um but now yeah so oakland had, like, it was really bad camera. like in the past like <laughs> 30 years <laughs> but now <laughs> oakland is chill because san francisco booted out all the people who had real jobs but can't afford to live in san francisco anymore now they all live in oakland <laughs> and then <laughs> richmond oh richmond's been fucked twice <laughs> so richmond they used to build ships there and like super big industrial city then chevron came in and then basically they dipped out all the jobs and just screwed everybody so the same had, thing in flint you had like a really big population of like uh like working six, class seven, people eight, and then all of a sudden no you jobs. just took away everything so richmond's honestly not a great area but i mean there's there's a whole there's like no on the coast there's a bunch of wealthy people right there oh yeah that's marin is just rich yeah. they actually blocked a bart station so they were going to build bart to marin and then marin was just like no we don't want the riprap so marin <laughs> doesn't have a bart station and that's why it's so nice that's crazy um Basically, if you build a BART station, the riffraff comes. That's kind of the moral of the story. And then this is all a state park. You can nice. poop anywhere here, as long as you clean it up. <laughs> That's kind of how the city is, too. Yeah. Don't no, you don't have to clean it up. You don't have to clean it up in the city. If you poop anywhere in the city, you just can't clean it up. <laughs> You're not allowed to. <laughs> wow. Wonderful tour. Can we can we give this man a round of applause? Woo! Woo! Yeah, <laughs> all right.